Hi everybody, Laura here. Thank you so much for joining me today. I'm excited to be a part of the Waffle Flower June release blog up. They have some awesome new products along with an exclusive new tropical kit. I'm going to start with this new Abstract Hearts Hot Foil Plate. I'm going to foil it up with this Prism Foil. So I'm going to get this Heat it up on my Spellbinders Glimmer Foil Machine. I do have a panel of Hammer Mill cardstock, and I let that sit for at least a minute on the green dot. Like, let it sit, marinate, get hot. I find I get better results, and it foiled like butter. Okay, now moving on to the tropical um, die. This, there's a tropical stamp die kit in this tropical kit. A bunch of stuff that comes in the kit. Uh, I'm going to be using just a few of the products. I fell in love with this. You know, I'm not even sure what kind of bird this is called. I should Google it. Okay, in my 30 second research, I don't know if this is a white macaw or a cockatoo. Okay, but they look kind of similar. Um, I don't know, but I'm going to piece it together. I kind of went off of the inspiration that I saw with the design team. So, uh, and also there's a, there's a really great guide that shows you how to put these all together and just follow that. And that's what I would do. So I did the base out of cream, the detailed bird body out of white, the little feather on the top and the bottom out of yellow. And then I did some different array of colors of leaves and blooms, getting the tropical vibes going. Okay. So I'm just going to glue this all together with a little bit of liquid glue. It comes together easy peasy lemon squeezy and speaking of that little phrase i say often a crafty friend of mine he's a dude crafter his name's andy Gran granick if i'm saying that correctly look him up andy granick he's a great card maker he was shopping i don't know where he was if it was hobby lobby but he saw this little wooden sign that says easy peasy lemon squeezy and he thought of me and he sent it to me with a cute little card and it made my day and uh, that just makes me chuckle when I think of people out and about living their life and seeing a, a phrase and thinking of me. Warms my heart. Okay, so I'm putting together the little, which I don't know. You got to look this up. Is, is it a white macaw or a cockatoo? Either way, I like saying cockatoo. It's kind of fun. Okay, so piecing together all little pieces. And you could probably make these different colors if you want to, you know, spice up your life. I'm just using that Barely Arts glue and that embellishment wand really makes it come together. Look at it. Cutest little cockatoo you ever knew. Okay, now I'm going to pop this up on that foiled background, which I trimmed down. I believe I trimmed it down to three and a quarter by four and a half. And that gives you a really nice thick border on your card base. Makes it look fancy schmancy. And I'm tucking all these little leaves in. I didn't really have a plan. I'm just tucking and going. Sometimes if you can't get a good tuck, snip a little off and then you can tuck it nicely. Little trick of the trade. And okay, so I'm just trying to get as much color as I can, getting the tropical vibes going. This is such a cool kit. You get a lot in it. Um, there's also uh, these little embellishment dots, these self-adhesive dots that come in the kit. And I'm going to add those to the tops of those little orange and yellow blooms. But I'm just finishing up all my tropical leaves there. And um, some I cut smaller, little snippets. You just gotta feel it, go with the tropical gut. Okay, and then now here's a neat one. There's some pre-printed sentiments that come in the kit that pair great with the sub, what's it? Sub sentiments die. So I die cut all those sentiments out in one shebang. And all these pre-printed sentiments coordinate really good with the tropical kind of theme we've got going on here. So aloha, miss you, have a sunny day. I went round and round. You know, you can go all day trying to figure out the right sentiment. I, I settled with aloha. And I just Googled what does aloha mean? I mean, I had an idea. I know they say aloha and they put the lei on you when you arrive in Hawaii, but it, it can mean hello or goodbye. So I'm going to go with hello because it's probably weird to send someone a goodbye card. But I guess if someone was leaving, you could send them a goodbye card. <laughs> I don't know. Okay, so I'm adding these little enamel dots 
in white, little ones, just to the center of the blooms. And I did zhuzh some of this stuff a bit because that's what you got to do in life. You got to zhuzh it like your life depended on it. And there you have a cute, came together, easy peasy, aloha cockatoo on a foiled background. Can't get any better than that. Make sure and check out the rest of the June blog hop for more incredible inspiration. Thank you so much for joining me. Have a wonderful day and I will see you next time.